Hola a todos! My name is Luana and I have been asked a few times about the classes, the EF classes, what they are like and stuff like that, what you learn, how they teach you, etc, etc. So today I will talk to you about that. Why did I just say it like that? Who knows? So a few weeks pre-departure, you will have to take an online exam which has a reading, listening and use of English. After that, the first day of school, the first Monday, you will have a very casual, very, very casual speaking exam, which doesn't even feel like an exam. Uh, I had two of those, one in Oxford and that one was just a teacher. He, she came to me and asked me a few personal questions like, where do you live, who do you live with, what are your hobbies, stuff like that. And in Hawaii, what I had to do is go to the front so all the new people were there and I had to stand in front of them and just give a little uh, sum up of what I am. Of what I am, of who I am. Uh, so I'm like, my name is Moana, I'm from Argentina, I'm, I am an EF ambassador, I have already travelled with the EF, um, I like the English language because blah, blah blah, I came to Hawaii because blah 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 and that'll be it. You don't even feel like you're being evaluated. After those two exams, the pre departure one and the speaking one, you will be assigned to your class. When you go to the class, if you feel like it is too easy or it is too hard, then you can ask for a change. So you can go to your teacher and you can go to a member of the staff and just tell them that you feel uncomfortable, that you don't feel like you're learning or like you can't follow the classes or whatever and they will change you, no problems. Now, let's speak about the classes. It doesn't matter if you are on a general, intensive exam preparation course or whatever you are doing. There are three different kind of classes. You have general classes, spring classes and I love. In general classes you do reading, listening, speaking, use of English, writing, all the general things that you always learn in an English class. Now there are four different methods of teaching. Now one of the things are games. Some of these games could be, for example, role-playing, charades, um, hangman, the hangman, pictionary. You will also be doing book exercises and obviously the books are included in the price. Besides the books, teachers usually bring photocopies with exercises which you do not have to pay, again. And the last thing you might be asked to do is a presentation pre uh, a presenta presentation damn about homework i was usually i was barely ever given homework so i had a lot of free times which i would spend either studying in my room or actually putting the language in practice now the spin classes are special interest lessons so the first day that you arrive you will be given a list with all the spin classes available and you will choose a few it depends on which if you're doing an intensive course then you will choose two uh, spin classes if you are doing a general course then you will choose just one spin class so you can either have uh, things especially related to the English language like vocabulary, reading, uh, writing, speaking whatever you feel like you struggle the most with that's this spin class that you should probably choose because then the whole lesson will be specifically about that. You also have some other kind of special interest lessons like for example global issues. Uh, you also have like politics, British culture if you go to, oh, to England or you have Hawaiian culture and then there's also a completely different kind of spin class which are, for example, surf classes if you go to an EF location that has a beach, dance classes, and then lastly you have iLabs, which are basically classes in a room full of computers. So you will use a computer, sometimes they ask you to do some research about something, and sometimes they give you free time so you can do whatever you want, you can even go on Netflix and watch an English movie, for example. Um, you can watch TED Talks, EF really encourages you to watch TED Talks which are very interesting. And that's it for today's video. If you liked it or it helped you in any way, shape or form, then smash the thumbs up below and if you did not, if you did not like it then do not bother. I, I will see you around very soon because I am trying to actually keep a schedule going. I am very disorganised. So I am not making any promises, alright? So yeah, adios.